wonder which of the original cast members are coming back to the magical world of Ordon and the Isle of Lost? Get ready for surprises as we unveil our top picks for the actors who should be in the Descendants 4 cast. We'll start with the fan favorite, Dove Cameron. Gaston should be jealous. <laughs> Unfortunately, we'll also start with some bad news. Dove Cameron, the actress who played Mal in the original Descendants franchise, will not return to reprise her role. Why? Well, because she thinks making Descendants 4 might be super wrong. A while ago, the actress was asked by Pop Buzz if she would do a Descendants reboot, and she replied no, adding that she doesn't think it would be the same without the whole original cast. She further explained that they have already told a complete story, meaning that another film would be pointless. In another interview with Hollywood Life, the actress said the idea of making another film following the death of her co-star, Cameron Boyce, might be super wrong. The strength of evil is good as none when stand before four hearts as one. What happened was so incredibly heart-wrenching for all of us and something we could not recover from, Dove explained. Not long after this interview, people and dedicated Descendants fans started throwing backlash at Disney for making a film following Cameron's death. Even after all these years, there are a lot of people who believe the fourth Descendants installment is a mistake. We don't know whether this is the reason Dove decided not to reprise her role in the upcoming movie, but we do know that she, along with some of her co-stars, find it difficult to return to the same set. Following her performance in Descendants, Kirsten has starred in Feel the Beat, Songbird, and My Little Pony, A New Generation. She also starred in the TV series Pretty Little Liars, The Perfectionist. Still, a lot of fans think she should have definitely been in Descendants 4. Luckily, we have a lot of new cast members. To a lot of people's surprise, Rita Ora has been cast in the new film. Huh? That's right, and I actually think the creators have made a perfect choice here. I can't think of anyone better than Aura for the role of Queen of Hearts. Per a report by Disney, the Queen of Hearts rules over the Kingdom of Wonderland with an iron fist. Disney also confirmed that the expansive new story will find polar opposites, Red and Chloe, the new protagonist, crossing paths at a momentous celebration in Auradon when unexpected chaos breaks out. So, in order to prevent a terrible event from happening, our new protagonist will have to join forces to travel back in time via a magical pocket watch created by the Mad Hatter's son. Sounds quite promising, right? Well, I'm really saddened that we won't see most of the OG characters. I do feel great about Kylie Cantrell being cast as Red. The amazingly talented Kylie is set to play the rebellious 16-year-old daughter of the Queen of Hearts. Kylie is without a doubt one of the best additions to the Descendants franchise. Of course, it would have been even better if she starred alongside the original cast members, but it is what it is. <laughs> there are some fans suggesting it would have been better if Disney started a brand new franchise rather than making a continuation of Descendants, a continuation that has different protagonists with a brand new cast ensemble. What do you guys think? Think. Oh, by the way, the movie is in good hands as Jennifer Fang is directing and co-executive producing with the story by Dan Fry and Russell Summer. In March 2023, almost a half a year after the film's official announcement, it was confirmed that Descendants 4 will be going under the working title of Descendants The Pocket Watch. However, one year later, it was announced that the film would officially be titled Descendants The Rise of Red. I know most of you expected to see Sophia Carson in The Rise of Red. Sadly, that is not going to happen. I am a god! I don't belong here! Carson, who played Evie in all the previous Descendants films, decided not to reprise her role in The Rise of Red. Four years ago, the actress told J14 that it would be a privilege to continue that story, adding that her character is a gift that keeps on giving. However, in September 2022, she told Entertainment Tonight that Descendants ended with Descendants 3 for them, adding that it's always so beautiful to see all of the love for the franchise, and I wish them the best of luck. But what about Mitchell Hope? Is he going to reprise the role of Ben? 
Ben, Mitchell Hope appeared in all Descendants movies as Ben, the son of Queen Belle and King Adam, better known as the characters Beauty and the Beast. We still don't know why Hope is not returning in the new film. We don't know whether he refused to be in it or he wasn't even offered the job. In an interview with J14, the actor said Descendants is a great franchise, and it was a lot of fun to be a part of. He seemed excited to continue the story, but again, he might have changed his mind. Nevertheless, we are happy that we are going to see Malia Baker as Chloe. Chloe is a cheerful 16-year-old daughter of Cinderella and Prince Charming. According to Disney, she's book smart and athletic, but her privilege makes her somewhat naive about the real world. She and Cantrell are going to make great protagonists. As a big fan of the Descendants franchise, I can't go on without mentioning the amazingly talented soul of Cameron Boyce. I know most of us would give anything to see him alive preparing for the new film, but life is not fair, and we really hope Cameron is in a better place now. The whole world was shocked when Cameron tragically passed away on July 6, 2019 after having a seizure in his sleep. He suffered from epilepsy and was only 20 years old at the time of his death. The actor appeared in Jesse, Steps, Gamer's Guide to Pretty Much Everything, and Rent. He was known for helping others and was involved in a lot of charity organizations before his death. We'll never forget you, Cameron. Boo Boo Stewart, the player who played Jay is not returning in Descendants 4. Honestly, I would have loved to see Boo Boo in the fourth installment, but it looks like the actor is super busy and was not able to star in a new Descendants film. Following the release of the first Descendants, he starred in Pitching Tent, Bad Company, Dominion, Descendants, Wicked World, Good People, Let Him Go, and a lot more projects. But hold on to your chanted wants. We've got an unexpected twist that will leave you spellbound. Keep watching to discover the magical surprise as we have in store as we continue with Sarah Jeffrey as Princess Audrey. Are you being our queen? No! Yes! <laughs> yes, yes! China Ann McLean and Melanie Paxton are the only OG cast members set to reprise their roles of Uma and Fairy Godmother respectively from previous Descendants films. I feel really happy with where I left things in the world, Sarah Jeffrey told J14 in March 2022, adding that she's happy with the character development that Princess Audrey got. The actress also shared her own theories about Audrey's future, explaining that she would love to see the character making some female friends, real friends, who she won't backstab. And last but not least, we're happy to see that we're going to see Brandy as Cinderella. Brandy will play Cinderella. The character is described as elegant, warm, good-hearted, and diplomatic. She will be reprising the role from when she starred in 1997 Cinderella. Believe it or not, Paola, who played Prince Charming in the 97 film, will be joining her in Descendants 4. This iconic on-screen couple appears in a short clip released by the official Disney Plus YouTube account. The two of them can be seen in costume on set. Cinderella's blue gown is perfect. Perfect. What do you guys think about the pocket watch? I mean, Descendants The Rise of Red. Let us know. That wraps up our list of top actors who should have been and deserve to be in Descendants 4. Did we forget to mention someone? Let us know in the comments below and don't forget to subscribe for more updates. You got this, girl!